Hey folks, Glenn May here with BassResource.com and I want to show you how to Texas rig a plastic bait. I know there's a lot of videos out there and they take you through it really fast. So I'm going to slow it down a little bit to, for you and show you a couple little nuances to make it so it's a lot easier to learn and a lot easier to do. You'll be a lot more successful with it. First thing you want to do is take your hook and line it up with the bait. And if you notice when I do this, look at the eye. It's buried in the bait. That's important because when you take your Texas rig, your, your sinker, you want it to sit flush against the bait itself. So you want that eye buried inside the bait. So line it up, take a look. Now look where that hook is supposed to go. Down here, it's right just below that appendage. That's important, make note of that, okay? First thing you wanna do, see how long the shank is? Look at how it is relative to the eye. So it's a little bit longer than this shank, this part, this part of the, uh, the hook. The front end is a little bit shorter than the long. Sometimes you can just bury the hook all the way up to the angle right there and then start turning, but because this is shorter, you wanna go about two thirds of the way in. So here we just go dead center, right in the middle, going about two thirds of the way, about that far, and then turn, just like that. And then as you bring it out, you wanna turn the hook around right about here, and let's bury that eye right in, just like so, okay. Now let's line it up again, see where we're at. Yep, right about where that appendage is, right about below that. So that's a good place to keep in mind. Now look at the angle that it goes in. It's almost straight up and down, perpendicular. So you really, you gotta bend this bait almost straight up like that and bring the hook point right into it, straight in, just like that. There we go, just like that. Now you got sticking out like that. So what you wanna do is you wanna push the bait up forward just a little bit and skin hook that point right back in the bait. So do it just like so. There, now it's nice and flush. You're not gonna get any weeds or anything on. I'm bringing my finger right across, you can see. It's not gonna get hooked up. Nice and straight, that's how you do it. It takes a little bit of practice, but once you're done, you've done it a few times, it's really easy. That's how you Texas rig a bait. For more tips like that, visit BassResource.com.